Hi, I'm Jacob. Um, we're with the Silent Age Alert System. Uh, here we have just a small demonstration of what we have working. So this is going to be our uh, microphone and antenna that we place in our classrooms and buildings to help uh, listen out for the code words that we set up if there's ever an intruder or a school shooter or something like that. So here at the top we have the microphone coming out and then we also have the antenna. So using keywords that we've set up such as reset and lifestar, we were able to get it to send um, transmit signals over here to our hub, which we have a Raspberry Pi here with this tray holder and an Arduino with a secondary antenna to receive signals from the primary antenna. What this will do is it'll send a signal to the Raspberry Pi, which will send out e uh, texts and, and phone calls to other teachers and staff and students. Uh, but the most important thing is probably that it's able to send out text and a location to emergency services to help uh, decrease the time that it takes for them to respond to a school shooting. Um, normally a school shooting, uh, it takes about 12 and a half minutes for police to respond, but school shootings only last for seven and a half. So with this, we're hoping to decrease that time to like kind of reduce the uh, number of injuries or deaths. Uh. So the way the system works is we have our node here, which is meant to be disguised as a camera. In the event that a teacher feels threatened, uh, she can say the words, life star, and as you can see, it sends a message, it sends a text message to your phone with the location that the alert was triggered, and then this is the call the authorities would get. From the silent agent alert system, an emergency alert has been triggered at Louisiana Tech University. Repeating, an emergency alert has been triggered at Louisiana Tech University. Once the authorities arrive at the building, they will have a... Um, a breakdown of where the alerts are occurring. So this is a location of, <laughs> this is a table of locations with the status at each location. So when they get there, they're not going in blind. The way all this works is we have a Raspberry Pi here that is basically the brains of the operation as you will. Whenever an alert is triggered on this node, it sends a signal with an encoded message to this transceiver on the other end. This is read in through a serial connection into the Raspberry Pi and it's processed accordingly. If it's an alert, it's going to take all the necessary um, steps to notify people and to alert um, on screen so that the person who is sitting in the office where this device is placed will automatically know what's going on. And as you can see, we have a console here so they can know um, they can be notified when an alert comes in. Okay, so this has been the Silent Agent Alert System. Uh, going forward, I want you to think about how our product can not only help others, but how it can also help you if you ever found yourself in a situation like this. I also want to thank a couple people. First off, our professor, Dr. Corbett. She was great help, helped us out with anything that we needed. Second off, the uh, president of the Association of Cyber Engineers. Uh, she was also a great help with the programming part, or the programming side of this project. Um, and anyone else that I missed, I want to thank you too. Oh my god. <laughs> 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 alright, alright, alright. Okay, we do. Okay. One, Serious. Okay, alright. One, two, three. Good. Okay, so using keywords that we've set up already, such as reset and uh, life alert. No. <laughs> Life alert. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we live. We live. <laughs> she can say the words "life star," and it will. Um, that was supposed to work. Life star. Oh, you have, you have damn it! Set. You have this Garbage. Yet. Damn it! Um, the school or you know whatever. Um, they'll have a...